Hello, my name is Christina Lynn Kadigui, and I am a student pharmacist at UT Tyler. Today, I will be talking to you about this venlafaxine, otherwise known as Pristique or Cadesla. So you're taking this medication because it is used to treat depression, and you would need to swallow it as a whole with water, meaning don't crush, break, or chew the tablet, and you would need to take it for several weeks before you start to see any effects. So even if the medication is not working out well, do not take more than the normal amount of doses that you have been instructed to, and you just need to speak to your doctor about it. And do not use if you are taking MAU inhibitors, especially if you have been using it for the past 14 days. And even after stopping this medication, do not use MAU inhibitors after at least one week or seven days after stopping this medication. And also do not drink alcohol with this medication and do not take any medications containing venlafaxine as well. And do not stop this suddenly because the doctor would need to decrease the dose before you are taking off this medication. And if you miss the dose, just take it as soon as possible. But if you're closer to your next scheduled dose, then skip the dose that you missed and just continue on with your normal schedule. And some side effects that can occur are allergic reactions, such as hives, difficulty breathing or swelling, and also anxiety, so you would notice nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, or hallucinations. Also confusion, eye pain, lightheadedness. So this medication can make you dizzy or drowsy. So you would want to avoid driving or doing any activities that require you to be alert just until you know how this medicine affects you. And also you seizures may occur and unusual bleeding or bruising as well. And you'd need to tell your healthcare provider before taking this medication if you are pregnant or breastfeeding, as well as if you have any kidney or liver disease, bleeding problems, glaucoma, heart or blood vessel disease, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, and a history of mania, seizures, or stroke. And especially if you are taking any other medications, such as amphetamines, blood thinners, including warfarin, any diuretics, any pain medications such as aspirin, naproxen, or any ibuprofen. And also if you're taking medications that treat migraine headaches, and if you're taking any tryptophan supplements as well. And to store your medication, you would need to keep it at room temperature in a closed container and away from moisture, heat, and light. Thank you so much for listening. That is all for today.